guy right now. He's at work, so he just left it outside for me. He's not answering, so I guess I'll just start driving home and whenever he sends it, I'll send him the money. Pretty nice couch, I must admit. A couple stains, but for $200, it's a Cindy Crawford. It should sell for at least $600. scratcher let's see see if we win all right let's see let's go not a winner took pictures of it I'm gonna load it up now I think I'm gonna post it for 650 and just see what happens it's a nice couch light gray is a hot color it does have a little bit of stains but not not bad at all Get this thing loaded up call it a wrap for now Alyssa picked up some furniture she's gonna start repainting and uh, fixing up furniture which is super cool I know there's a lot of youtubers that do it she's been watching a lot of them learning how to do it so that's gonna be a new addition to the channel, something fresh. She's gonna be sanding them down, repainting them, rebuilding them, stuff like that, changing the knobs and everything. Picked up our first project yesterday. I think when we go home, she might be working on it already. So I'll show you guys that. We're back at the house. Alyssa is working on her, her furniture that she got to flip. Kind of getting started. Here is what it looks like right now. We haven't touched any of this. We just took the drawers out. We're applying some paint remover to get, get all the uh, old paint off. So we're doing the drawers first. Then we're gonna do these. Strip everything down, get it down to the wood, and then repaint over it. Um, this is our first time doing this, so. Hopefully it goes well. Alyssa's been watching YouTube videos and trying to figure out how to do it, so she's the boss. You know what to do. <laughs> she's the boss woman around these parts. Got all of this stuff for $50. $50 for all this stuff. I think we can sell it for about two or 300 if we do it right. So let's get to work. <laughs> into my box truck and I heard a buzzing noise I'm not trying to get stung never gotten stung in my life and today ain't the day oh nice let's go Take 
goes to work. <laughs> hey, yo. <laughs> To do with these those can pretty much just slide like up in there somewhere <laughs> i think we can actually put a lot of bags like we're gonna just fill all this with bags yeah. all right here so i guess let's just start from the boxes yeah from the back Alright, this is what it's looking like. First load, almost complete, pretty much full, all the way to the top. I think we're gonna do, hopefully, cross our fingers one more trip and it'll be done. We're taking all this stuff to a storage unit and uh, yeah, hopefully we can knock it out in one more trip. Alright, just unloaded everything at the storage unit for trip one. Uh, now we got another truckload full of stuff. We gotta go load up and take back here. There's always more like more stuff. Whenever we she first told us about the job, it was a bed frame and some bags. Now it's a bed set and like her whole house. And we quoted her 200 originally and we already bumped it up to 350. And she said the storage unit we were taking it to was close. It ended up it's 26 minutes to get back. Bro, we got to talk to her about that. To load up this other trip yep. and hopefully call right, it we're getting finished with load two this is all super super heavy furniture um all that stuff in the back too all super solid wood super heavy mirrors super fragile stuff glass fine old stuff it's a lot i didn't really have time to film we're gonna go in grab kind of the last of it and then go back and unload all this stuff again let's get it Head into the storage unit for trip number two. We got the back all filled up to the very top. There's stuff overflowing into the cab. Um, we're praying that these, all this stuff fits in her storage unit because if it doesn't, I don't know what we're gonna do. I mean, what do we do? Just leave it on the curb? <laughs> like, we're 20 minutes away from the storage unit. I'm gonna unload this and then I'm gonna cheers to never moving again. I think I'm, I'm done with the moving business. <laughs> Like houses at least. If you want like a couple pieces of furniture moved, sure. But the pay to sweat and time ratio isn't there for me. Me and Matt were talking about it. It makes you appreciate the couch flipping game because you can buy a couch for 100, 200 bucks and sell it the next day for five, 600 bucks, making like four or $500 profit and you've only wasted about an hour of your time two hours of your time maybe we're getting paid 375 and me and Matt have to split that so one no 350 and then we're getting 175 each and then we've been working we started at one it's about six o'clock right now we're not gonna finish till seven five hours of work and we're getting paid less than if we would have just flipped the couch made three four five hundred dollars profit and it took maybe an hour or two hours tops so I think we're done with the moving gigs. <laughs> Unless it's like really lucrative, but I don't know. Usually not, nope. All right, let's see. It's a big birthday. <laughs> Drop it and then pull it back. Just don't let it like fall forward. Yeah. Okay. Yep. 
All right, let's see. You might have to hop in here because I don't want to scratch that glass on the bottom side. Yeah, true. <laughs> now this big hefty piece of a equipment. This is the heaviest thing, huh? No, the dresser for sure. You think? The dresser looks heavy. Last piece. There's a glass in here. Last thing. And that's a wrap. Job is complete. We got the cash right here, 350, which we have to split two ways, equaling 175 a piece. Uh, if we could go back in time, would we do it again? Hell no. But it's done. We got paid. And uh, we're gonna go get some food now. Matt has a couch to deliver after this. Which I don't know how you have the energy to go do that right now, but what are you gonna sell it for? Uh, six twenty-five. Six twenty-five. Sorry. Six twenty-five, and you got it for how much? Uh, two fifty actually. So you're making what? What is that? Three seventy-five. Three seventy-five profit, and it's gonna take him like what an hour to go there and back. Yeah, and probably. And then we just worked six hours for 175 bucks. Sheesh. Dropped off Matt. He went to go deliver a couch right now. It's nine o'clock. So he's going to end up getting to those people's house at like 9, 30, 10. He got it for 200 or 250. I forgot what he said. And he's selling it for 625. Um, so he's making way more money just in 30 minutes than we did the whole day moving. It really makes you appreciate the couch flipping game and how good it really is at 175 bucks each for six hours of work now of course that is also my pricing i need to work on my pricing uh if i would have said a number that i'm happy with then could have been a different story but that's what we're working with now so i'm gonna call it a wrap for today it's nine o'clock now it's thursday which means tomorrow is friday i gotta upload the video for you guys so i'm gonna go home edit the video and get it posted for you guys tomorrow so that's what i'm gonna be doing hope you guys are chasing your goals chasing your dreams accomplishing stuff uh, and just getting out and doing whatever it is that you want to do love you guys we'll see you in the next one peace